take them down, don't you the way. I'll take that under advisement. Optional, do not kill any guards. I'm definitely not going to kill any guards. Okay. Perfect. If I remember correctly, in this level, you can get like. I just received that little present you sent me. It's a bit disturbing to think that SKX is still alive. Last time I saw that psycho, half his face lined the inside of a trunk. Well, the body was never recovered, so I guess the chance he survived was always there. I mean, the goddamn mayor's lying dead in the next room and no one saw it. Mr. Thomas, the coroner just arrived. He's examining the body now. I'll keep you posted if anything turns up. Okay, here are the. I forgot that I was supposed to be following this junk. <laughs> I just went off on my own. Why is it optional to not kill any of the guards? Why. So Thomas is an actual scumbag if it lets you just kill these guys. They didn't even, they wanted to put sneaking in, but they didn't add a crouch. <laughs> don't kick the can, don't kick the can. So it did lead me right where I need to be. I just had to go the roundabout okay, way. This is what we know so far. That sucks. The victim is Mayor Rachel Mars, age 55, found dead inside the City Museum of Natural History. Body has severe lacerations about the back, chest, and arms, resulting in excessive hemorrhaging. There's also an extensive tearing of muscle and ligament within the same region. Head decapitated just above the collarbone. The whereabouts is still unknown. All right, and now for the note you sent me. Found on the victim's body was a piece of paper with strangely drawn eyes on one side, and on the other, the acronym of a serial killer known as Serial Killer X, both written with a black felt tip pen. Did you find any fingerprints on the paper? Yes. I ran it through IAFIS, and guess whose name popped up? Leland Van Horn. I don't need to tell you this, but let's make it official. Leland Van Horn, a.k.a. Serial Killer X, or just SKX, was allegedly responsible for nine serial murders in the greater metro area. He's the nephew to Malcolm Van Horn, and was thought to be dead, killed by a gunshot to the face. His body was never recovered. Yeah, he shot himself, even though I spared him. Do you think Van Horn nursed his nephew back to health? I'd say it's the most likely scenario. I have a theory. SKX gets one in the grill. His own flesh and blood, Malcolm Van Horn, nurses him back to health. SKX turns on his uncle and kills him. For perhaps the same reason he murders Rachel Mars. Keep searching the museum. We need more information. I mean, there's an obvious weapon right here. Receiving image. Good work. That's an odd-shaped saw. Looks medieval in origin. Get a shot of the handle, will you? Yes, ma'am. Anything for you, Rosa. Got it. Excellent. Look at that. A fingerprint. Give me a moment. Okay, over 50% of the fingerprint found on the handle is compromised by smudging. However, after running the print through IAFIS, I'm able to get a positive match on our suspect, SKX. I'd say SKX is very much alive and is now the prime suspect in the murder of Rachel Mars. That's weird. What about the saw? You said it looked medieval. Yeah, I hear the museum will feature one of the largest yeah, medieval exhibits in the country. I think you can get like swords and Find stuff. Find the exhibit that tool came from. SKX was certainly there at one point. Not, not what I wanted. Get out of there. 1501. Okay, hold on a sec. Camera 1501 was installed a week ago and just completed its 48 hour stress test. Ethan, if you think SKX may be on camera, find the surveillance room and let's take a look. Yeah, you can get like, ooh, baton. 
Obviously, I won't use it on the guards. Yeah, this guy is a beast. So much for not killing. Look at him, he's so bloodied up, it's ridiculous. But hey. The game says that he's not dead, so that's all I care about. Just knock out a guard and drink the liquor. That's what it's all about. The game reminds me of my life. Okay, I'm in the surveillance room. Find the backup drive and let's see if our favorite madman has made a cameo. I thought it was 1501, or maybe it was 1504. Could have sworn it was 1501, though. Oh. Okay, the feed is coming in now. Jesus Christ, that's freaking grim. I don't like that. Yeah, uh, very disturbing. <laughs> Yo, man, my man just hit, tried to hit me with a roundhouse. I think he did hit me with a roundhouse. I hate how bloodied they are from me fighting them, but... What else am I gonna do? I remember getting swords and stuff. Pretty sick. <laughs> that was pretty sick. Ooh, paper cutter. Yo, he did a lot of damage to me. I need to. I just am too aggressive. I want to do a uh, finisher on one of these cases. Rosa, I found a museum directory. Good. Tell me the area of the museum you want to find, and I'll update your GPS. It would be a tool. Got it. Let me check the blueprints. It, it's okay, trying to trick you. Your GPS has been updated. It wants you to go to... I do want to go to 20A, though. Oh! <gasps> Can I let him down? That's awful. Yo, those... Oh, God. Oh, I thought he had a sword for a second. You almost got me, buddy. You almost got me. Broadsword. Yes. A 
Well, I don't know if Ethan's worthy of holding to a bronze sword or broadsword. I got a sword too. Oh, I remember you get attacked by dudes in full armor and jump. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no. These freaking scumbags. How do. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Mmm. Time to die. Head on. <laughs> Punk. With all the glass in your frickin' face. Where'd your buddy run to? He wants to die too, huh? Jump out at me. Oh. You're a runner, huh? Jeez, she's a frickin' runner and a half. She's gotta be here somewhere, right? Did she get away? Oh my god. You're kidding me. I'm really butthurt. I'll find her. Where is... Oh, it's right there. <clears throat> Got it. Warhammer. Don't mind if I do. There's also more broadswords. I'll stay with the Warhammer for now. We'll try that out. Can I get over there? You can't jump in this game. Oh god. I saw a guy over there. Good night. The runner's back. Question is, do I wanna wanna save her for a while? Jesus. A guard! No! This scumbag, she just killed the guard! And this guy. This is for the guard. Mm. Crunch! You think you're done? Not even close. Mm. Where the heck did this guy come from? What a scumbag. At least I broke her arm and her leg and then shoved her face in some glass. Dang it. What the heck, another guard. I can save you. Do I lose the challenge because they killed him? No, it's still... I still have it. Not that it really matters. I 
rather just keep them alive just to keep them alive. Oh, guard. Oh, Jesus. Dude, nice job, guard. Dude, good job, though. You're, you live now. Oh, we have the level three... I, just want, I want the broadsword. Let's do it. Receiving image. Nice work. Looks gruesome. Are we sure it's even blood and not red paint? Get a sample so we can determine one way or another. What do I use to get a sample? It said blood a second ago. Blood. Oh. There. That's how you and do it. Collect a sample of those weird looking metal pieces. Collect metal pieces. Receiving sample data from your field kit now. Let's see. Blood type is AB negative, which is the same as Rachel Mars. Less than 1% of adults have this type, so I would say we have a match. All right, now let's take a look at those metal pieces. Evidence sample consists of thin metal strips and small bolt-shaped pins. Alloy it's like the, what that final boss of the first game had all over match them. known foundry formulas. Blood, human tissue, and bone fragments are present on all surfaces of sample. The evidence the metal pieces are from... Any evidence the metal pieces came from Rachel Mars' body? Yes. The coroner oh, wow. has found extensive scar tissue throughout her body and bored holes in her bones, matching the dimensions of the metal pieces you Jesus. discovered. He, like, I tore them out? Rachel Mars had a secret, and it may have gotten her killed. What? Some sort of fucked up masochistic lifestyle? Whatever it was, it looked painful. The pathology report will tell us if she was abusing painkillers. Ethan, the cops are on their way. We finally managed to get a warrant to search the rest of the museum. Get to the main lobby if you can. If I can't, like, get the knight armor, that'd be too sick, I guess. Oh, holy cow. Charging me. Ow! Another guy? We have level three. Okay. The broadsword taking care of business. We have, uh, so... I'm gonna try out the level three on the next guy I see. Probably. Oh god, not him. Oh. Punk. Ow. So we gotta get rid of the guard quick. You know what? I'm gonna go use level three on this guy. I see you coming. Oh, attack him. Right trigger. Punch, punch, punch. Oh, snap, crackle. I almost punched him too many times. Okay, we saved him. Night, night. Holy cow. Doing my broadsword back. Is this something I can photograph? Look at this photograph. Maybe this one? I know it. it the jump. Am I stuck in here now? Am I really stuck in here now? This has got to be a joke. You've got to be joking with me. Oh, 
Oh, we got out. Oh my god, dude. I would have been so butthurt. Okay, remind me not to get in... Oh, maybe we go down there. But it did say I could interact with this. But down there is where I came from, I think, so... Go through here. Jesus. Is this the guy with the armor? He missed. I gotta get a frickin' weapon. My frickin' sword broke. Oh god, there's another guy in here. Run it. I really gotta take this guy out with my bare hands. Let's do it. Oh, here comes the other guy. Jesus. Someone's telling me I really need a freaking weapon. Oh, no, he just breaks. That's right. So I was supposed to just run. Crud, I was sitting there fighting him. Here we go, got ourselves a sword now. Insane. I liked it. A little scary. I need these health pills. Pills here. Crossbows. <laughs> it's no fun. All right, we got all three of them. Step over. You can't just walk over it. Oh, Jesus! Too bad I couldn't see what the heck happened. I mean, I know it was the armored guy that hit me, but Oh, 
Freaking sword broke. Ooh. I want to use the freaking crossbows. It didn't hurt nearly as bad as I thought it was going to. Ooh. Ouch. Can I? Am I hurting him with my fists so? though? I'm just gonna have to swallow my oh god, swallow my pride. I've been sitting here for like oh I'm missing. Oh wow, he's going down, dude. <laughs> this is, I don't remember this very much, dude. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Good night. And the way he just chucked the axe on him, that was sick, dude. That was so sick. Yeah, I guess they just really wanted you to use the crossbow. I broke his armor and stuff and hit him with the sword, but I was literally running around for like 10 minutes just punching him with my fists, and nothing was happening. You're looking more beat up every time I see you. I think you overstayed my welcome. I found something when investigating Van Horn's body. Metal pieces? No, 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 something better. I found traces of fecal matter on his shoes. Something better. Yeah, I found finish, poop on his shoes. It belongs to an endangered deer species found only in the Black Lake region. You mean the wildlife preserve up north? Yeah, I figure the best way to track SKX is to start with Van Horn and work our way back. Seems like a long shot if you ask me. Two hour flight tops. I'll make the arrangements for a plane to take you there. <sighs> All right. I could use some sleep. Good. Dorland here has volunteered to take you. Oh god. Don't trust him. What do you hope to find up there? Jesus. <laughs> the target just boarded the plane. Tension is palpable. Alright, there we go. Another silver level. Drop up to two waypoints in your GPS. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay. So I guess we're done with our... What? Photograph strange artifacts? We didn't complete that? How many were there? I don't know, but we didn't kill any guards. All right, after this cutscene, I'm going to call it. I had a, quite a long session today. Ethan, your chest x-ray shows you do have vocal cords similar to Van Horn's. But even more bizarre. I'm related to Van Horn, is that what you're saying? The thought crossed my mind. However, I was able to confirm that you do not share blood with that family. That's comforting. But you still think I'm connected somehow? Yes, I do. It just seems kind of crazy, that's all. When you land, search the lodge thoroughly and learn as much as you can. It's been abandoned for decades, but I have a hunch both Van Horns were there recently. <sighs> How much time we got left? Hey, buddy, did you hear me? Hello, Ethan. We don't have much time, so I'll get right to the point. Your old boss, Pharaoh, is trying to protect you. Have you taken a moment to contemplate the meaning of this? He's the one that hired you. He guided you through the ranks of SCU and has kept a close watch on your career. Perhaps he's done this under false pretenses. He may have ulterior motives using you. Something to think about when choosing your friends. Jesus. Heck happened to him. Oh shit! Mayday, mayday! This is flight 324. Come in. 
Damn, how did he die? Did Thomas kill him? There you go. I hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough. We finished the game. Oh. Do you really expect to find anything out here other than a gold death? Maybe. That's an interesting place for them to end up <laughs> if they were in the cockpit. What like happened to you, home slice? Alright, anyway, before we get going, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hopefully you're enjoying the playthrough so far. We done some more you know since the first couple episodes we've done some more cool environmental takedowns that axe finisher against that armored thug so sick the uh the crusher on the lollipop girl whatever her name is the lunatic so sick so i've been having fun i still know what the heck's going on in the story so don't ask me but if you if you know what the heck's going on maybe you could tell me a thing or two i'm just here to to do some fighting and we've been doing a lot of that, so I've been having fun. I'm looking forward to see you guys in the next episode. It should be a good one.